a front three, despite what we see there. Josh McGuinness will operate from the rear start at international level for a player who can't get into his club side, Boa Vista. They do. Or, you know, the set players are something we're particularly good at. I think we're very strong on the left side with Shane Ferguson playing as an attack. It's Banov. And it's Mylov breaking in from the right side. And Northern Ireland must be on their metal here at this set piece. We have uh, some pace up front and in the wide areas for just this sort of situation. And Shedayev might get in here. Can he find the end product? Neat skill, and that's a really searching ball, and it's Ferguson arriving. We'll only find the side netting. Absolutely brilliant play from Conor McLaughlin, coming down the right-hand side, fake to put it in with his right foot, checks on the left, great ball in, over the head of everybody, Shane Ferguson, far post, should have hit the target, he'd be disappointed with that one, but it's a smashing piece of play from Northern Ireland. And he's got to hit the target, he's got to get it square, or at least get it across the face of the goal. You don't miss it at the... In from McGuinness. Oh, the bounce could be tricky, it's front. Here he is with the throw. McCauley and Evans, Johnny Evans have taken the opportunity to move forward. It's Johnny Evans quick, it's Lafferty's finish! The from Michael and the boys, long throw in, flick on by Johnny Evans, half volley, what a great half volley in his right foot, that is from Kyle Lafferty. Gets his knee over the top, has to be spot on, great goal. And you know, they've been threatening, and now they've got it, that's the breakthrough. And it's only taken them, what, 20-odd minutes, 26 minutes in quality, yeah, that's brilliant, really, really brilliant. And now they can push on from that. Brunt whip it in towards that far post area. McCauley's there! Look at this delivery from Chris Brunt, absolutely top drawer, super, super. And then Gaz gets up, he tars over everybody, and he buries the ball in the back of the net. No, goal, no goalkeeper's got any chance of that one. What a delivery, and what a great goal. And that's the points in the bag. That's brilliant, absolutely brilliant from Gaz McCauley. His ninth goal for Northern Ireland. Wow, for a centre-half, that... The right foot. McLaughlin! Oh, what a goal. Goodness. Well, his first goal for Northern Ireland certainly does settle the nerves. And it's turning into a perfect night for Northern Ireland and Michael O'Neill. Well, it's one of the best nights I've seen for Connor as well, his distribution and his possession coming forward. But look at this header. He gets a half a yard, and it's a bullet header. He gets across the front of the... The defender, and it's a bullet header. What a good goal that is. Oh, Connor, you will remember that goal for a long time, son, I'll tell you. Cla cracking goal, he gets across um, Amar Guliev. And that's a super header, 3-0. Well, it's coasting time now, isn't it? It's turning out to be a very comprehensive victory, and it was just... Brunt, McGuinness... Oh, 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 he's done it! Bronte certainly had it, Daniel, but did anybody get a touch? Well, that's the question everybody's asking. Chris Brunt getting the credit. Steve Davis with a smile on his face. I think he got a lot of touch on it, Steve Davis. I do think he got a slight touch on it, but they're giving it to Bronte. Have a look. And it's a good run initially. Steve Davis picks it up, comes inside, and his initial effort is blocked here. Falls kindly for Chris Brunt. Now, what's the strike? Does he let it? 